there's a fountain in the middle and there's it's a quadrant and uh, there's a walkway coming in from all four corners and it's right in the center of the park where the fountain is is where I used to do my most of my shoe shine. I wasn't the only one shining shoe. Oh. There's a lot of boys uh, shining shoes there and I'm fortunate my brother set me up in business put together a little shoe shine box and put the five cents on it. And oh, that's 五十多年后，在公园里擦鞋的于福庆进驻公园对面的庄严建筑，成为加州首府沙加缅度市首位华人市长。In looking back, of course, that my beginnings were very humble. My family did not have a lot. My dad emigrated here from China near Guangzhou, a little village called Luchong, and because my grandfather. Had wanted them to come over here and perhaps see if there is a better life over here, and so my father came over here in the early 1900s. I worked very hard as a tailor and a cook, whatever kind of job they can find, to earn enough money, and to go back to China, and bring my mother over. I, they weren't any different. There were many other. Asians that did it the same way. They came over here, worked hard, saved a little money, go back and bring the mother over. And uh, subsequently, they they settled down here in Sacramento, where I was born. So I'm a native-born uh, Chinese American. Mother, due to not being able to speak English, only worked in a shop in the clothing factory. 父亲则在街角开了个小杂货铺。尽管父母每天都从早上八点干活干到晚上八点，但对于这个四女两男的八口之家来说，生活依然拮据We didn't have a lot of money, like everyone else. I mean, we were no different than anyone else. We had lim limited income. Uh, I still remember back in those days when uh, we had a family get together dinner. We had a, you know, a steak, but we didn't have a steak for each one of us. There was one steak in the middle of the table, and we sliced that up. Each one had a couple of slices. Uh, but you do what you can. And I still remember when I was a child that my brother, my older brother, used to shine shoes. And he made pretty good money at it. And then when I say pretty good money back then, you know, you got to remember that was、uh, 55 years ago.、Uh, so this park that's across from City Hall is where we used to come and shine shoes, and we shine shoes for a nickel a shine. So you can see now when you go to the airport, the shoe shine costs you five dollars. Well, back then I shine shoes for five cents. Never did I believe. Or envisioned that one day I would be sitting in this office overlooking the same park where I used to shine shoes for five cents. 站在办公室的窗户前，眺望对面熟悉但却不属于童年的小公园，回首往事，日子虽然艰苦，但并非不是快乐的。I go back then. I don't see anybody shining shoes there anymore. <laughs> But at the same time, it does bring back a lot of good memories. I think everyone should always think back about some of the things they've done、uh, when they were a lot younger, because、uh, you know, good good memories are always there.、Mm -hmm. uh, not everything is bad. You know, you, you look at things in the past and you had fun.、Mm -hmm. I still remember when I was a young child,、uh, we didn't have a scooter like you have today with those、uh, high-tech wheels and、uh, fancy、uh, scooters. We used to get a, a piece of board and get an old skate and split it in half for our wheels, and we nail an apple box on top of the, the piece of wood, and that was our scooter.、Mm -hmm. You know,、uh, our shoes. It's、uh, we didn't have enough to buy new shoes. 
And so we used to go to the uh, Woolworth and buy those shoe mending uh, kits. Uh, they give you a piece of rubber and you cut it along the, the size of your shoe and you glue it on. It's, uh, in fact, when we couldn't afford to buy the kits, we used to put cardboard on the bottom of our shoes so that our feet isn't touching the ground. But uh, 对于福庆而言，与自己的过去只有一窗之隔。也许是巧合，但一定是幸运的。他可以常常面对过去，警醒自己。Because there's nothing wrong with being poor, mm -hmm. nothing wrong with that, uh, as long as you have the drive and the ambition to get yourself out of that situation, and that's the key. And the one I always preach, that part of my life makes me appreciate what I have today. Uh, if things are just handed to you, you never get that same kind of appreciation. But if you have to work hard to get where you're at. Uh, Things that have more value, and that speaks even for my own business because I started my own business back in 1966, and we had a very difficult time. Uh, there were probably almost a year go by with no income, none. And I still remember when my sister-in-law used to come by the house and leave a bag of groceries or leave a little money for us to use because they. They knew that I was not having an easy time. Yu Fuqing, 1966, 年成立的那家结构工程公司，在二十五年后成为沙加缅都市最大的结构工程资讯公司之一。他们设计的会议中心、首府银行、河景广场和萨特总医院等，均成为沙加缅都市的标志性建筑。但是，在成立之初，他们甚至无法从银行获得贷款。And so one day we went to、uh, the bank to try to borrow money. We had accounts receivable, but that's not cash. So. We went to the bank, tried to borrow money, and the bank wouldn't loan us any money because we had no, we had no background,、uh, no collateral, and so they wouldn't give us a loan. I mean, that's how difficult it was back then. And again, you know, good thing for family. It's、uh, your last resort when everything fails. You can always rely on family. And I had a brother-in-law that was willing to loan me ten thousand dollars. This is almost 35 years ago. That's a lot of money back then, and with that, it was able enable us to get over that hump. And eventually, of course, we're able to establish a, a structural engineering business was the the largest firm in the valley, and I'm very proud of that.、Uh, but I'm very disappointed, of course, that my father、uh, did not live long enough to see me. Establish my own business. That's you know those are some of the things that, when you look back and and see what your parents had given you, you always hope that you're able to show them that what they did for you was well worth it. And that's one of the biggest disappointments in my life that I wasn't able to to、uh, show my dad that I was successful in business. And of course, eventually being the mayor, I'm sure he would have been real proud. Of his son. Yu Fuqing said, "Father is knowledge and wisdom is important. So he knows what his own home is worth to his father. With regard to his father's regret, Yu Fuqing is responsible for making sure that he can make young people proud." I think in order to encourage more people. In the future, to do what you have done, you have to go out and prove yourself. Also,、mm -hmm. if you don't do it, people will not follow you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, in order to be a leader, you've got to be the first to get out there and do some of these things that hasn't been done before.、Mm -hmm. 
And through that respect, that's why I consider myself as a role model, whether I like it or not. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, it's, it's things that we can do today in order to encourage our younger generation in the future to say, hey, it's been done before. Mm -hmm. So if I want to do it, I'm sure that uh, you know, it's possible. It's uh, in order to, to ensure that some of the future generation do what I am doing. I traveled to Atlanta uh, a couple of months ago to speak at the Organization of Chinese Americans at their national conference. It's not so much I just want to speak to somebody, but the fact that I am one of the very few, if not the only, Chinese American mayor in a major city in the United States. It made me go there because of that in order to encourage the younger generation that, hey, you don't have to, to stay down where you're at. Look up and beyond and become the mayor of your city, wherever that may be. It's possible. And so that was the message that I was trying to get across. Uh, and I also told them how I got started so that they have an idea, if they're interested in doing things like this, that they can do the same thing. Ashishirji,七十年代,一夫庆开始关注社区问题,并成为当地一个华人组织的支持者。他参与成立了亚洲人护理之家,帮助年老或疾病在身的亚洲人。一九八九年,他组织发起了美国第一个向亚洲输送
Uh, you don't have to be an attorney. Uh, you don't have to be a doctor. I mean, anyone can do it as long as you have the time and common sense. It's, uh, it's nice to have a uh, business background because so many of our issues with the city involves economics. And so it'd be nice to be able to, you know, fall back on some, some uh, economic background. But uh, the issues are so broad that no one can come into an office and say they're familiar with all of them. So there's going to be a time in office where you're on the job training getting a feeling for what all these different issues are. And event, it doesn't take too long, uh, maybe a, a year or two, and then you have a pretty good handle mm -hmm. on all these different issues and how to uh, address them. Yifuqing就职之后,着手解决少数民族的福利,城市建设等重大问题,并组织了沙加缅度市长会议。邻近各市的市长在这个会议上讨论城市联合和地域性发展等问题。解决问题首先要知道问题。and uh, you, you can't go in with a predetermined uh, idea. You got to listen to people, what their problems are, look at the pluses and minus, and then you can make a, a good judgment mm -hmm. on how to proceed. I've learned over all these years that I, I've been in politics, you cannot please everyone all the time. So there's going to be some differences, but as long as you're upfront with people, uh, people will respect you even if you don't agree with them. People like yourself, Jackie, who have demonstrated your willingness to be part of the world by giving, not just of your time and money, but also the effort that you give to all of us. And so I've got this little key. <laughs> oh, this is the key to my car. You in here? I do have here in this uh, city of Sacramento receptacle here, a key to the city which I will present to you. And like I say, it's only given to the very most important, most honored citizen. It's really a symbol of respect to those people who has raised to the pinnacle of their profession or have sometimes shown that they are worthy of being considered a citizen, honor citizen of the city of Sacramento. To that, as the mayor, on behalf of the city council, I present this key to the city. So you can come into my office anytime. <laughs> Yifuqing将象征沙加缅度市荣誉市民的钥匙赠给了成龙，他把这看作是使命、责任，而不是特权。Special privilege? I don't believe so. Uh, I have no special privilege, but let me just say this much. Uh, there's certainly a lot of little benefits that uh, comes along with being the mayor. Uh, you, know, you get invited to so many different functions, uh, you know, including to your, your function just the other night. Uh, it's, uh, the, uh, what is the American Leadership? Uh, yeah, the American uh, International Leadership. International Leadership Foundations. Yeah, that was a great event. Uh, uh, I get invited to a lot of basketball games, uh, golfing outings. I get invited to so many activities, including dinners. Uh, but that's what takes a lot of the time. Uh, sometimes, you know, you feel like you'd rather sit at home and have a hot dog <laughs> because uh, you go to so many dinners. Yeah. Uh, no, as far as benefits uh, or perks, 
we don't get too many other than you know a lot of invitation i do get free parking uh, at city parking yeah, lots so yeah. Uh, you know, I laugh about it because that's a very <laughs> minimum thing. It's yeah. uh, you just have to enjoy being the, a mayor without all these, you know, expecting yeah. any benefits. But yeah. Uh, yeah. there's there's a lot of enjoyment to it. This is Yu Fuqing's Xin Tiao. Find your own place, do things you can do. For unpredictable things, accept the facts. 客观也好，实用也罢，总之，于福庆的这套处事原则让他很少有烦恼。Goals that are are reasonable. You don't want to expect the sun. It's、uh, if if you're open-minded to yourself and you're able to to talk to people. A lot of time you get rid of your frustrations just by talking. Of course, talking to other people and sharing some of your concerns.、Uh, I don't have blood pressure. You know, I. Or high blood pressure that comes from a, a lot of of tension. If you don't let it go,、mm -hmm. I, I think I've been able to handle a lot because I don't let it bundle itself in me.、Uh, I think being able to to、uh, handle a lot of the issues without getting yourself all frustrated is、uh, one way of of、uh, addressing the issues of disappointments. Hey, there's going to be disappointments in life throughout your life, but make sure they're just Minor ones, and don't let it get yourself to a point where it, you know becomes a major issue.、Um, sometimes you just have to accept the fact that certain things just don't work, and by accepting the fact, you limit yourself to any further frustrations. It's、uh, that's how I've been able to try to handle some of these issues,、uh, and don't let it get to me. 只有接受失败，才能摆脱失败，进而开出一片新的天地。于福庆的人生道路有过多少沟坎，我们无从知晓。但是，从他连续三届十二年荣任市议员，从他当选市长时的全票通过，从沙家缅度市恬静祥和的市容，从于福庆的处之泰弱中，我们或许可以体味出一二吧。I'm trying to look back and see, you know, when did I have really a disappointing、uh, part of my life,、mm -hmm. and、uh, it's very, very hard to find anything. I've, I've been blessed that、uh, I haven't had to、uh, go through some of those times when the, there's very big disappointment in my life. Like I said, I, I was disappointed in the fact that my Parents weren't alive when I was able to succeed in my business,、uh, being elected to political office. Some those are things that I'm, I'm disappointed. But as far as major disappointments in my life,、uh, I'm very fortunate <laughs> that I don't recall that I have had to face a lot of disappointments.、Uh, I've been blessed. It's、uh, been lucky that、uh, things, everything, kind of fall in place.、Uh, so to that extent,、uh, I'm very happy. 于福庆结婚四十六年，育有六个子女，十个孙子孙女。在他看来，这是他人生最大的一笔财富。In looking back, I I think I've done a lot of things that I would do. In fact,、uh, my wife gets very upset with me when I tell her, one of these days when I'm gone, don't cry for me. I I. Believe I've done everything I have wanted. I have a good family. They're all educated. I have a very large family with ten、uh, grandchildren. They're they're all doing fine. I mean, that's what life is all about: is that you provide something for them so that they can get a good step in the in their future.、Uh, I've had a good business. I have a a wife 
46 years. That's a long time. I'm looking forward to it, at least 50 years. Uh, I think I've done everything that I've wanted to do. And so when I tell her, don't cry for me, she gets very upset. But, uh, you know, I, it, and looking back, it's, uh, life is very short. And you got to do what you have to do while you're here. And looking back, I, I just feel that uh, I've done everything I wanted to do. And uh, one of these days, when the time is right, uh, I'll be ready to leave. Yu Fuqing is a member But uh, meanwhile, I'll still have fun. I'm still learning how to play golf. <laughs> I don't know. I've been playing for 35 years, still don't know how to play golf. But uh, hopefully one of these days I'll get better. And, uh, you know, it's very nice to also look back and see the grandchildren starting to grow up and, and your own children maturing. Mm -hmm. uh, this is the good part of life mm -hmm. where you can sit back a little bit and start enjoying them. Mm -hmm. Uh, the fact that the, the children and grandchildren come back to visit you, uh, those are some of the dividends that I'm getting back now. I love to play with them when I have the time. I tease the little grandkids. And, uh, that's the fun part of life now. You can take that one there. That one? Yeah. Okay. So we let them go first? They're ready. Yeah, you got to step on the heart. Hey, you want your picture in Beijing TV? You better... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, then oh, you're going to follow you. are going to follow you all this time. They're all the way from Beijing. Wow. Oh, yeah, this wow. is all my friends from the church. Yeah. Why? Men from blue, men from blue, singles from gold. Oh, you see Davis, okay. Ah, friend. Good. Oh, 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 back. Oh, yeah. Oh, It's all right. It's all right. <laughs> That's a good 